Blackman's Law of Limiting Factor. The rate of photosynthesis is affected by more than one factor that is carbon dioxide concentration, temperature and light. As per law of limiting factor, at any given time, the rate of photosynthesis depends on factor which is the lowest. For example, if optimum light and carbon dioxide is available and temperature is very low, then rate of photosynthesis will be controlled by temperature. That is, increase in temperature, there will be increase in the rate of photosynthesis and then there will be a steady state. Second, if temperature and carbon dioxide are at its optimum level, then light will decide the rate of photosynthesis. Increase in the light intensity, there will be increase in the rate of photosynthesis. Further, if optimum temperature and light is there and carbon dioxide is minimum, then the rate of photosynthesis will be decided by carbon dioxide concentration. Increase in the carbon dioxide concentration, there will be increase in the rate of photosynthesis and then there will be a steady state. Thus, at a time, only one factor control the rate and is called limiting factor. This law of limiting factor is applicable to any biochemical reaction. It states that if a chemical biochemical process is affected by more than one factor, then the rate will be determined by the factor which is nearest to its minimal value. It is a factor which directly affect the rate if its quantity is changed.